welcome back everyone. Second show this week. I told you I was going to do more. This is a follow-up to the one I did on Monday around Mother's Day ideas. Remember that one? How'd you go with that? What have you got that can help people looking for Mother's Day ideas? All right. That's just the start of where you need to be thinking with this. If you are a B2C retailer, uh, heck, even a street performer, maybe you can do some street performance on the nature strip for Mother's Day. Who knows? I don't know if that's allowed. Probably not. Don't do that. But there are other things that you could be looking at, and this is the big one. So, I told you about Mother's Day ideas. Well, look at this phrase. Gift delivery. Hmm. That's, that's growing. Now, today, Andrew Chen, who I talked about on Monday with all the data he was showing from, I think it was Slackline, something like that, Stackline, maybe, I don't know. Sorry if I misquoted the brand. He's also talked today about uh, food delivery. This is the big one, though, and this will probably be the next one he comes up with, which is gift delivery. Why is it the big one? Well, let me give you some perspective. This is the last seven days, okay, for Australia. This is the past 30 days. Okay, significant. Okay. This is the past 90 days. Huh. Now, what's interesting here in the past 90 days is that this big spike here, which is, of course, Valentine's Day. There are two, essentially two main dates for gift delivery in Australia, and they are Valentine's Day and they are Christmas. Hmm. Let's take it out a bit further. Let's go 12 months. So we get that Christmas peak in there. Oh my. <laughs> now, have a think about this. Why? Why is it happening? Now, I've spoken to a number of uh, gift hamper suppliers and florists, and they are the major beneficiaries of this right now. There are exceptions to that, some clever stores out there. And I, I think some of the uh, clever uh, retailers have already noted this and have doubled down on doing gift vouchers. Good idea. Why is it happening? Simple. Really, when you think about it, you go, of course. Why didn't I think of that, Jim? Everyone's at home. I can't go to your birthday now as much as I wanted to. I really I was looking forward to it. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna compensate. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'll buy you something online. I'll send you something. That'll be fun. Everyone is doing that now, okay? You know, it used to be with Mother's Day, some, some people even used to just you know, go and buy a gift on the way to their mum's place. I've heard, that's what I've heard. I don't know if that's true. People tell me that. Well, they can't do that now. They've got a plan, they've got to think. Now, that's just 12 months, and you can see that it's already more than probably double what it would normally be at peak times during the year. So, when we take that out even further <laughs> to last five years, we can see that this, and then we take it out for all time, is actually, I'm going to use the U word here, it's unprecedented. <laughs> right? We have to buy something. We need to buy gifts. This dotted line is telling us where it's going to go because this is predicting for all of April. Mm. So, what are you doing? And when you go and have a look down here, gift delivery Sydney, same day delivery, gift hampers, birthday gift delivery, gift delivery Perth. Once again, the important thing here, well, one of the important things here is to understand is that people who are typing this in haven't decided on what gift they're buying yet. They just want to know what they can get delivered. So, the retailers that are really going to, we've already teed up, um, teed up a, a few of our retailers uh, who, who would be ripe for this. So, get some gift idea categories, get some gift packs, get have, can you do gift wrapping? Can you do personal messaging? These are the things that you've got to look at because the retailers that can do those things now 
are really going to capitalize on this trend. Because it's like if you go into a store, a normal shop, bricks and mortar, and you might be asking the person, there might be, you might strike up a conversation with the person behind the counter and they might say, oh, what's this for? Who are you buying this? So oh, it's a gift from my, for my mum, for my dad, for my brother. Oh, do you want me to gift wrap it for you? That'd be awesome, thank you. So if you can do that online, and you can send a message with the gift as it's been delivered, fantastic. No one wants to order a gift, get it home, pay shipping, repack it, wrap it, put a card in it, take it back down to the post office, pay shipping again. No one wants to do that, right? They just want to be able to get a gift to their loved ones. It is spiking, it will continue to spike. And there'll be a whole raft of different things. The way that you can capitalize on this, of course, is gift delivery is gonna be very expensive in AdWords now, obviously. Sorry, hamper people, sorry florists. Um, there's a few, who I know will probably be a bit grumpy at me this morning. But hey, this is good for every retailer, right? And I want every retailer to understand this because it helps all of us. Uh, and there's enough business to go around that we won't be taking it off uh, the hamper people. And we won't be taking it off the flowers people. They're always going to get that traffic. It's just at the moment, they're getting a lot more of that traffic than what they can actually handle. Right? I've even spoken to um, some people that would sell industrial equipment. And I've said, have you got any tools that you could maybe package up as gifts? Have you got something that could constitute a gift? Start talking about it on your site, start talking about it in social, start reflecting that in your ads, start reflecting that in your EDMs. Let your database know that you can do gifts because most retailers don't understand this. They actually sell gifts, they really do. But Online, that is not a focus because gift delivery is the realm of gift hampers and flowers. So we thought, well, now's the time to change that. Now's the time to look at what you've got, how you can lay out your navigation so it makes sense for people looking for gifts. Is your search function working properly on your site? Have you done a mystery shop? for people trying to buy gifts? Have you done a mystery shop of your site in general to make sure everything's working? I did this, I explained to uh, someone via LinkedIn the other night. Hi, Stephen. They had a new service launching, a new um, food delivery service launching. Uh, the sign up process asked me to give a password in the sign up process, and then they sent it back to me in clear text, in an email, and ask me to change it, right? That's a major, 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 major security issue for them. But I found it simply with a mystery shop to go and say, hey, you probably don't wanna do this because you're probably gonna get into trouble and a lot of people are gonna be very, very grumpy at you. So the mystery shop is important, right? From the sign up through to the delivery. Get the branding in the package. If you're an eBay seller, if you're an Amazon seller, for goodness sake, make sure you got your branding in the package. How do I know to come back to you? How do I know that you make it easy? There's, there's obviously uh, challenges if you're doing uh, 3PL and those sorts of things, but it doesn't mean that you can't sell gifts and package them as such on your site. Hopefully that's helpful. It should be. Let me know how you go. Let me know if you're using this. I've already worded up a few e-commerce mates and they've just gone, of course. It's stupid, right? Of course, what, what? Yes, of course. So it'll be a couple of days before the rest of the world wakes up. So you've probably got a little bit of a head start to start getting your site in order. Our clients have already had a little bit of a head start. Uh, and now you have as well. Hopefully that's helpful, and we will see you next week. Thanks very much. Bye.